jewel of Fort Worth architecture and the art scene turns 50 today. Fox 4's Hannah Bata joining us live at the Kimball Art Museum where a golden anniversary gets underway today. Good morning. Uh, good morning, you guys. A golden anniversary, and they are certainly celebrating it like that. This morning, we're talking to Eric Lee, the director of the museum, and, and we're in the actual anniversary exhibition. Can you talk about this room that we're in right now? Well, we decided to, uh, to organize an exhibition that celebrates the first 50 years of the Kimball. And so that's where we are now in the Kahn building, the original building that opened 50 years ago today. And we have video monitors and, and digital, a digital exhibition as well that looks into the history of the Kimball. We've got um, photographs from throughout the 50 years the, uh, of the Kimball, both then and now we'll have education programs as they were 50 years ago, and then education programs today comparing the two. So yeah. it's a wonderful look back at our history. I mean, just over your shoulder, I'm looking at a photo from the groundbreaking decades ago. It's crazy to think back when of what the museum was and, and what it's become. And one thing that I feel is just really special is you said this was sort of a thank you to all the guests in the community that made it what it is today. Absolutely, the community has been has helped make the Kimball the great institution that it, that it is. So we thought of this anniversary as the celebrations for the anniversary as being a thank you to the community. And so that's what, what we've, we've tried to make it. And the whole week of the 50th anniversary is, is very much you know, a thank you to the community. We have a family festival on Saturday from 1 to 7.30 with concerts beginning at 4 o'clock with Abraham Alexander and, and the band Katinga, and we're very much looking forward to that. The exhibitions are free this week. The permanent collection at the Kimball is always free, but our special collections uh, often have charges, but we're going to be fr entirely free for the whole week. So I hope everyone comes out and, uh, and visits the Kimball during this, this celebratory week. Yeah, a better time now more than ever. And I'm sure, Eric, too, someone watching this out there has never had the chance to visit the museum. What would you just say, uh, what would you say to someone from North Texas who hasn't been out here yet, who, who's maybe thinking, you know what, this is something I'd want to go see. What could they expect to experience? Well, this is one of the most beautiful museums in the world and certainly one of the most beautiful spots in North, North Texas. We have great architecture, great collections, great exhibitions and programs. And so uh, I think the Kimball is one of the finest museums uh, in the world. And so they should come visit. There's no reason not to. The permanent collection is always free, as I said. And, uh, and this week, everything at the museum is free. So um, they, they should come visit. It's one of the, the icons of Fort Worth, one of the icons of Texas. And the building we're in, the Louis Kahn building that opened uh, 50 years ago, it's considered one of the greatest works of art in the world, one of the greatest works of architecture mm -hmm. in the world, one of the most influential buildings ever built. So um, everyone should come visit. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for chatting with us, and, and happy 50th anniversary yet again. Well, thank you so much. <laughs> We're going to put information up on our website for the event he was talking about that's free to the public on Saturday. We'll have all of those details where you can get some food, check out the exhibitions, and uh, check out a concert as well. That'll be up on our website at fox4news.com.